viewers today i'm going to take you through a system of uh, generating exams automatically using microsoft excel it's a very simple system with very few coding that will be enabling you to automatically set exams without a struggle as long as you have a data bank of several questions for instance in my data bank here I've I have around 500 questions of computer studies I can still have as many questions in other subjects and be able to generate exams with their marking scheme uh, these are the questions and these are the answers in my sheet one I have questions and I have the answers like list uh, the components of a system hardware these are the answers we have the input the processor the storage and the output and then when you move and uh, if i go to sheet 2 i have created now a pattern here that if you click generate exam it will be creating in this case i've created just for 15 questions but you can have the standard one for 20 questions i just to change the number of questions in this case it produces 15 questions and then uh, you can print preview and see how it will appear and also you can also print and have it a hard copy and give the uh, produce more copies for students so for instance if you can see number one here is to convert the following number this system does not repeat a question it picks one question from the data bank it cannot repeat the same question in the same paper if this convert the following numbers to their decimal equivalent the way it is here you cannot find another question another question number with this same question it cannot be there it cannot be there so uh, it's a very smart system that will enable you make your work easier now for instance if i click generate exam you see the number one the title for this case is Andrasa boys high school exam computer studies I can have a title for your school, I can um, just um, edit and have it. You can as well copy the everything and then paste it in Microsoft Word to do some editing if you wanted, but if you are very fast, there is no need. Because if you have put the correct school as the heading, everything comes right. And then if I print preview here, you see it uh, looks smart, it looks smart, the paper looks smart and standard. So you, from there, uh, you can do the printing. It will print on the printer attached to the computer. So you see this is a different question and different arrangement, no repetition. If I click generate again, you can see it. number one is different from the other one. It is what do you understand by the following me control measures against computer, crime info, audit trail, data. If I click generate again, present between COM port and LPT port you see these are different questions all the same these are different questions there is no repeated question if you go from the first question to the last question there is no repeated question you realize there's no question that has been repeated there is no question that has been repeated these are 15 questions so from there you print preview you can go through all the paper yes print preview and then uh, you print your paper and give for duplication of copies so that you give your students so you see this a smart exam setter that is will make work easier for the teachers if you may want uh, this file you can reach me on 07 24 595 i repeat 07 595-589 so that you can we can talk and you have the file for computer studies it's ready for around 500 questions for other subject you can give me for a maximum of two weeks to have 1000 or 500 questions for you and then and a marking scheme that you will be generating I'll show you in the next episode on how to generate the marking scheme that is my next episode of how generating the marking scheme automatically so i'll be having another pattern that is in sheet three i'll be having generate marking scheme i'll be having generate marking scheme here generate marking scheme say that the marking scheme will be appearing automatically and then you print 
So that is my next video. Thank you for listening. If you've liked this tutorial, subscribe and share. And then you can reach out on me so that you can have this file to help you 